My name is Courtney, I'm 17 years old and I live in Edinburgh. Courtney, you ready, darling? I go volunteer with my dad five times a week and we feed the homeless. I absolutely love going. Do you like a gift? Veteran, good job for homeless people. I volunteer with the charity Steps to Hope. They are being funded by Comic Relief to provide accommodation to people experiencing homelessness and addiction. You're welcome. The food van is a great way for us to meet people who are most in need. You're welcome, enjoy, you too. It is estimated that there are hundreds of thousands of people in the UK without a secure place to call home. Here, pal, here. You want a juice? The people who are homeless, their lives are just full of chaos. Uh, would you like socks? And nothing's stable at all. I'm in temporary accommodation, which has been achieved through Step Strong. Without them, I would probably still be on the streets now. The people that we help, they're not just homeless people or addicts. Jamie, are you wanting a butter roll? They are somebody's loved one. John? From first-hand experience, I know that it's a very worrying time when a loved one is homeless. So this is your biggie? Um, so it's my dad's charity, actually. Is it? Cheers, Richard. Right, OK. We'll see you in the morning, eh? When I was growing up, my dad was a drug addict, so there was a lot of hard and upsetting times. When things got tough at home, my dad couldn't stay with us anymore. I used to just sit in my room and just think about where's dad, where's he went. I hope he's safe. When I was 10, 11 year old, my dad relapsed. I'd had to say to him that I couldn't have him in my life anymore until he got better. I'd say it was nine, ten months that I wasn't talking to him at all. It was devastating. Then on Christmas Day, he had asked me if I wanted to go with him to hand stuff out to the homeless. I immediately said yes. I felt like my dad was really, really trying to change his life. We handed out 10 Santa sacks of clothes to the homeless. Then the next again year, it was 40. You're now able to provide longer term housing too. We've been doing a lot of cleaning today. We're just making sure everything's ready to move into model. This flat is for someone who Steps to Hope has helped through the Substance Recovery Programme. Having a roof over your head does open so many doors. People having relationships again with their family, building better relationships with friends. That looks nice. It's amazing. I am very proud of my dad. Home sweet home. He's been able to turn his life around and has now been able to turn other people's Life's around. Get involved with your school this Red Nose Day and you could help people in the UK and around the world Thank you. in need of a safe, secure place to call home. <laughs>